Welcome to our step-by-step -step guide on crafting delightful faceless educational cartoons for kids. This instructive kids channel earned ranging from $13,000 to $828,000 in the last 30 days by uploading faceless animated cartoons about different topics. A video about naming dinosaurs for kids, for example, has received over 3 million views. So, in this video, I'll show you how to make animated faceless videos quickly and efficiently using my greatest way yet. And, just so you know, this is applicable to any single niche. Whether you're an educator, content creator, or just passionate about making learning fun, let's dive into the magical world of animation. 1. Choose an engaging theme. Select a topic that excites and captivates young minds. Now visit ChatGPT and you're going to ask it for this prompt. Give me 15 simple video ideas for a niche educational faceless channel. And over here, all you want to do is insert your niche, kids. 2. Write script from ChatGPT. You can go about getting your script is by using, once again, ChatGPT. You want to ask it for this prompt, for example. Write me a short script for an educational YouTube video titled, Name the Fruits. That would be the title of my video. Include basic fruits, naming them and how to spell them. And then the target audience is kids. So whether you decide to use the ChatGPT script, create your own script or edit this script to fit your needs better. Faceless characters are relatable to a diverse audience. Kids stay engaged with the educational message, free from distractions. Now, let's bring your educational cartoon to life. 3. Character Design Now visit Canva and do this. So now our video is about fruits. I have three fruits, a pear, an apple, and an orange. Create lovable, faceless characters that resonate with your audience. Where we can begin creating the characters. And I swear to you, this part is super easy, but it's also super fun. Give them some body parts. Arrange body parts with fruits and edit to resemble cool looking fruits. Also add face on your fruit. And it's literally done by a few clicks of a button. You can change the color of feet and arms. So in order to bring them to life, we're going to be using this tool called Animated Drawings. And on this page over here where it says Upload Photo, you want to upload the photo of the characters that we just downloaded from Canva. And now here's the great thing about this tool. We only had to do this once to generate him. Then figure out the different movements that you like and you'd need your character to do. Look at him just running across the screen. Our animation is done and then download it directly or you can use Screencastify to record and download it. 4. Voiceover. Narration. Record a friendly and clear voiceover to guide the narrative. Or, in order to generate the voices, we're going to be using Eleven Labs. The first thing you need to do is select the voice you want. In order to do this, you're simply going to click on the drop-down arrow, scroll through all the different voices, listen to them, and then just click on the one you want to use. Use an enthusiastic tone to maintain children's interest. And now, once you have downloaded the voice congratulations, because now there's only one step left. 5. Edit video from Canva. Because what you're going to do now is put everything together to generate your amazing video. So the first thing you would need to do is click on to where it says Uploads and upload all the files that you just downloaded onto Canva. So from here, the first thing you need to do is get a background for your animation. Feel free to adjust it even further to bring it more to life. By that I mean going to where it says Edit Photo. So now that you have the background, you can now begin generating the actual scene. It has this white background, so we need to get rid of it. But from here, you need to make it more visually appealing. In order to do this, you'd want to add in the text of what your character is actually saying. You could adjust the text font, the sizing, the color, the effects, the animation. Resize and edit the title to look good on top. And then from here, what you want to do is take a look at your script and figure out what your character is saying. And then you want to crop and adjust your animation accordingly. You can improve it according to your need. Add the voiceover you have generated from 11labs.io. Visit Pixabay to search kids music and download it from here. Integrate catchy tunes that aid memory retention. Use music to make learning fun and memorable. You can download this video from the share option. You can make many cartoons like that on every fruit name. Let's check out the video. Hello, can you guess what fruit I am? 
I am a pear. P-E-A-R spells pear. 